ultimately the difference between Start9 and I don't want to go through every possible competitor, but the one that people ask about the most is Umbral, is the essential architecture of the platform itself. Umbral has, in short, taken a bunch of open source, self-hosted software services off the shelf, packaged them into a Docker Compose file, and you hit start. It is a completely, I will say simple, I will dare say naive, bundled, fragile approach to the solution of an average person running self-hosted software services. And anyone who has run Numbral will tell you that as soon as anything goes wrong, it is SSH, command line, you put on your dev hat, you get under the woods, and you're back to being a car mechanic. The problem has not been solved. What they have solved is essentially the following. Let's say you have a very technical friend, somebody who knows how to self-host and install all these services, and you don't know how to. So they come over to your house and they're like, all right, I'm going to get you set up. And they pull up in your computer and they're like, don't worry about what I'm doing. And they're just hacking and they install everything on your computer, right? And they're like, check it out. You got Bitcoin running, you got Lightning running, you got this running, you got this running. You know, if you want to use Bitcoin, just go plug the address in over here and you're good to go. And then they're like, and they leave. Great. You now have all these things running on your computer, but you have no way of managing them on a, in a, on a per, per, perpetual basis. You're sort of on your own now. So the value that that friend provided for you was to bootstrap you. They basically got you up and running and then walked out. And so now any issue that you have, you are calling them, you are getting on the command line. Again, you're putting your dev hat back on. And ultimately that is not something that an average person is going to be able to use. Secondly, the more this person installed, the more things they're running on your computer, the more likely that these uh, sort of obscure edge case or even performance-based issues are going to arise. Right. So what has happened here is Umbral has essentially become a marketing engine that has de derived a single one to one ratio. The more services we announce, the more hype people get, the more devices we sell. But what's underlying all of that is at best a rickety house of twigs that is never going to scale to the masses because this because the system is not sophisticated enough it is not robust enough to handle the kind of weight that they are piling onto it without building the necessary functionality under the hood to accommodate the user experience so that's all i'm going to say about them